Hey everyone, it's Nate Johnson here from FlyPlugins.com and welcome to this documentation video on our new Wishlist member integration. Essentially, this integration will allow you to take registrations from a particular membership level with Wishlist member plugin and associate those with enrollment, automatic enrollment in a WP Courseware course. So the first thing you'll need to do is obviously have WP Courseware installed, Wishlist member installed, and then you need to install the new Wishlist member add-on, as you can see here at the bottom of our installed plugin screen. Now, once you have the new add-on installed and activated, We'll go over to our WP Courseware settings, and you'll see now we have Wishlist member here. So we can go in, essentially, and we'll see at the top of the screen Wishlist member and automatic course access settings. And you'll see some level IDs here on the left-hand side. You'll see level names. These are the level names that you have created within Wishlist member. So let's go over and take a look at Wishlist member quickly. And you can see that if we go into membership levels, we have all of our membership levels listed here. So once you have created membership levels in Wishlist member and created training courses within WP Courseware, and as you can see here, we have a list of training courses in the My Training Courses screen. Once you have Wishlist member membership levels and WP Courseware training courses, all you need to do is go to this Wishlist member setting in WP Courseware, go in and edit course access settings for a particular Wishlist member level. And as you can see, now we can edit permissions for the gold level with Wishlist member, and we can assign WP Courseware courses to that Wishlist member membership level. What this means is if we check a WP Courseware course and we associate it with our gold level in Wishlist member, basically every time Wishlist member registers a new user for the gold level, they are going to be given course access to the particular course that you've selected. You'll obviously save changes, and that's all there is to it. Now let's flip back over to the Wishlist member screen and take one more look at one of the settings here that I wanna show you. If you're automatically enrolling uh, users for a membership level into a particular WP Courseware course, the last thing you may wanna change is the redirect for that particular membership level. So if you'll recall, we were uh, editing the gold membership level within WP Courseware so that all members registered for the gold level are associated with a particular course. We can go in and actually select to redirect logins uh, and registrations to that WP Courseware training course page if we choose. Uh, so that's one last setting that you may want to utilize. You don't have to. Uh, really, all there is to it is to go to that Wishlist member setting within WP Courseware and edit course access settings and associate the Wishlist member membership level with the WP Courseware course. So that's all there is to it. I know a lot of you have asked for this integration, so we're very excited to be providing it. Enjoy. Let us know if you have any questions. Thanks for watching.